Hello everybody! This video will show you how to download and listen to music on an Android device, smartphone or tablet PC. Dear friends, if you need to recover deleted data, use Utilities by Hetman Software. Follow the link in the description to visit our website, download a utility for free and install it. Then start disk analysis. When the process is over, it will show the files available for recovery, and you will be able to bring them back. Our blog features quick guides to solve all kinds of problems faced by Windows users. Our channel and blog offer solutions for any issues, from installing the operating system to remote administration and connecting mobile devices. Our specialists will be glad to answer your questions in comments to videos and articles. All ways of downloading music to a device can be divided into two types – from another device, most often a computer, or online from the Internet. To download music from the computer, connect your smartphone or tablet PC to a USB port of your computer with a cable which is usually supplied with the device. As a result, the device will start charging and an icon will appear on the screen to show that it is connected to the computer. In the folder of this PC, your device will appear as a separate disk or media, depending on the device model and settings. Often a memory card and the device's internal memory are shown as two separate disks. After that, in the smartphone or tablet PC, open the folder where you want to download music and copy it there from the computer. After that, disconnect the device from the PC and now you can listen to music from the folder where you have copied it to. If your device has a memory card installed, you can also download music there with the help of a card reader. To do it, uh, take out the memory card and insert it into the card reader. After that, copy music to the memory card, as I have shown you before. This method can also be used if you need to recover files from a memory card in a camera, phone, tablet PC, video camera or a dashboard camera. There is a special video about it, find the link in the description. If you have no cable to connect your device to the computer or you find it uncomfortable for some reason, you can send music to a smartphone or tablet PC without connecting to the computer as well. You can use Bluetooth, if your computer has it. In order to connect a mobile device and the computer, turn on Bluetooth on both devices and send files. You can also use cloud services, such as Google Drive, OneDrive or Dropbox. In this case, upload the folder containing music to the cloud storage. Sign in your cloud account from the Android device and use the device to go to the folder you have uploaded before and download the files or folders to your Android device. You can read an article in our blog about recovering or deleting files from cloud storages Google Drive, OneDrive, Dropbox – you can find the link in the description. Another method is by using FTP, though this method is the least known, but it looks like the most correct. To use it, you don't have to install anything on your computer, as everything can be done with Windows standard tools. The same applies to latest versions of Android. Some older versions may require one of the apps – an FTP server or client. There is a good choice of them in Play Market. My smartphone comes with an FTP client pre-installed. In order to use it, go to File Explorer – sometimes it is called File Manager. Select Remote Control – Enable Remote Control. We've got a line with an FTP address. To go to the files in your device from the computer, enter this FTP address in the computer's file manager. After connect uh, the PC and Android device must be in one network, that is, they must receive Internet connection from one router. After connecting, just copy the music from the computer to the smartphone, just as in my case. In the end, make sure you disable the FTP connection in the smartphone, it improves your security and extends battery life. Alright, the music has been downloaded into the Android device, what is there to play it with? Latest versions of Android have quite good music players and their functions are fine with most users. When you open a music file of a supported format, it will be played by the integrated video player. It has a special shortcut. Of course, settings and functions are minimal. In Google Play, you can find lots of alternative players. You can choose any. For example, here is the first one on the list – PI Music Player. In fact, it is a good player with a proper selection of settings and functions, a good equalizer and a convenient interface.
I tried some others, some I liked and some I didn't, but it is all my point of view. However, the fact remains that many alternative players are better than the default one. I would also like to say a couple of words about musical services for Android and not only. They differ from ordinary players by their ability to play music from online or even download it to your device so you can listen to it offline. There are a lot of similar apps, streaming services such as Yandex Music, Google Play Music, Deezer, Spotify and so on. For those who have a large collection of music but wouldn't like to use the precious memory of their mobile devices, there is a good solution – apps that stream music from your own cloud storage. One of such programs is Cloud Player by Double Twist. This is the case when the application is not just a heap of extra options, but all necessary functions are state-of-the-art. Unlike Google Play Music, all you have to do is to place your tracks into the cloud storage, and no other actions in your browser are necessary. This app supports work with such services as Dropbox, Google Drive and OneDrive. There is no automatic caching, but you can download files, albums and playlists manually. You can find the links to all apps shown in this video in the description. Of course, these are not all possible ways of listening to music on Android. Similarly, this video was not trying to create a rating for such apps. It is here to help anyone who wants to make listening to music on their Android device more comfortable. Even if you don't use this or another app, you can search for other similar products. If you like this video, click the like button below and subscribe to our channel to see more. Thank you for watching and good luck!